At the time the news crew visited Ubo to ascertain the fate of Comrade Stone the Kabaka Adun following the expiration of the seven day ultimatum handed down to him by the Edo State Government to vacate the property, it was gathered that residents of the community, passers by, street archers, and others, including journalists, besieged the premises of the hotel to ascertain whether the property in dispute would be demolished. After hours of waiting, when the officials of the government failed to execute the demolition exercise, some street archers and residents appealed to the state government to receive its decision to demolish the property. I don't really do politics, but because he's a very kind brother to us, that was why we came from the local government. I'm begging the state governor to please assist him and allow the have house mercy. be. Have mercy. No matter what he has done, he should have mercy on Tony Kabaka. We gave them the approval, over approval of that primary school. And they did survey. And they fenced the primary school. The governor should also see Tony Kabaka as a good man, as a brother. No matter how uh, this is politics, tomorrow both of them will also be together again. He himself is also our father of Obaseki. Anything that comes up is not like it's out of annoyance. It's for him to forgive our own brother. What did you have found here yesterday night? We got good to you. You say Obaseki, Wakos Kata, you know, say your daddy, and you came out, so I'm going to go to the place. Comrade Tony Kabaka Adun, who was obviously affected by the planned demolition, again re echoed his appeal to the state government to have a rethink and not push through with the demolition of his property. And also today, why people come to solidarize with me, I want to use this opportunity to thank the Edo people, as well as the diaspora and whatever Edo people, and the Nigeria at large. I want to thank you. For your support in life, people could do those where your name they are not here with us. With the children, with the way the children just spoke now, can everybody see reason that there's a need for you to be doing good in life? Yes. yes. So they even plead on my behalf. I'm telling the governor, so please. Have mercy. It was gathered that the Federal High Court in Benin has, however, restrained a Edo State government from demolishing the property. What I'm telling the world is because the court have already restrained them not to come and destroy my property. And you can see the entire youth of Edo State from various local government come to solidarize with me. That shows that the governor, even though I wrong him in any way by playing politics, or uh, by freedom of speech, I want the governor to please have mercy, and God will also have mercy on him. Best Mbire reporting.